What is going on guys, BCD here, and today I just want to bring you a quick video, and this is going over the Pixel Bud 2020, the 2.0 version, the better edition. Um, these are to compete with the Apple AirPods um, at that level, not the AirPod Pro, I don't think, maybe. It has a little features that can, um, you know, that are better than the AirPod Pro, but these are really meant for the AirPods. Uh, these are probably and probably is the best product that Google has put out in quite some time. That includes the Google Stadia, the Pixel 4, the Pixel 4 um, XL, the Pixel 3 XL. The 3A was okay. Um, this is probably going back to like Nexus um, times for me. Um, Google has not really been doing that great of a job, but these here show that they actually paid attention they took their time they did research they actually you know know what what made the airpods the airpods and what made people want to buy them and they kind of implemented it in their own way um, they have adaptive sound they have some things that the actual airpods do not include that are really cool they have google assistant tied into it which is far superior to siri and um i i can Take that bet any day but i don't want it to be a airpod versus um, google pixel buds review i just kind of want to tell you what i enjoy about these so what i do enjoy about these now is the casing the casing feels very smooth very very slight to the touch and not it's not as clunky as the previous one i remember you know trying to charge my uh earbuds and they wouldn't actually charge because of connectivity issues i'm not sure why but these they feel like they have a solid click uh, so when you when they're in there they are you know they have that connection they are charging you can be assured of that it's too many times where i would try to pull them back out and they would still be dead because they weren't actually charging um, but with these you feel the connection they have that magnetic strip in them so that they actually connect properly and it's pretty good um, fit and comfort it fits perfectly in my ear with the medium um, ear tips. Um, I know they have three additional ones that you can put in uh, that for, for comfort level, but these work right out the box perfect for me. Um, I think these are the medium ones that come in the box. I'm not sure if they have four different sets. I think they only have three, but um, they work perfect right out the box and they fit correct. They had a great seal for, for added sound. Um, a lot of bass in it. I felt like I had a clear, um, like, like a, a very much improved um, audio experience than the previous Pixels. But um, they have a smaller form factor. Um, as you can tell, they aren't, they don't have a string attached to them. You don't have to worry about it, something hanging around your neck. Um, it's something that is very functional in a lot of different ways. They have a, again, clear sound. They have a, magnetic um casing they can have an indicator on the outside so you can tell that they're charging or they where, where their battery life is they had they're, they're still type c charging so it's pretty fast when it comes to charge time um it's just a huge improvement over the old ones and and as you can tell they're not as nearly as clunky as the previous ones i enjoy my pixel buds while i had them but God, was it an awful product. These are not an awful product. These are a great product. It's a product that deserves to your money. It deserved my money. That's why I purchased it. I don't believe this is this is needs a review. I recommend them um, just off of the strength of my initial experience. Um, and that's pretty much all I have for it. I don't really have much else. Um, the setup was pretty simple. If you have anything above, I think, Android 5.0, don't quote me on that, you should be able to connect via quick connect is something that's on the pixels it's a way for you to connect um, quickly um, but you also can use the normal bluetooth methods um, for any device it has a button on the back that you can use to auto connect to anything bluetooth again comfort level is out of this world they feel right they feel good and they sound great and pricing is 179 so i do get that if you want to kind of hold off on it but um they were perfect for me they were a great mix between the airpods and the airpod pros for functionality but that's pretty much it for me i want to thank you guys for watching if you like this don't forget to like and subscribe i'll talk to you guys in the next one peace <laughs>